So while at Blade Show Texas, I found out the actual knife that John Wick will be carrying in the next movie that's coming out here in a few days. Now, recently I filmed a video talking about the knives that I thought could possibly make it into the next movie. Now, to be honest, I would have been right with my actual number one pick, but I did not have that knife to feature in the video, so it just did not make the list because I didn't have one on hand to show you guys. But now we know for sure, let's check it out. All right, guys, so this is the G&G Hawk Deadlock, and it is an OTF that has zero play. So if you know anything about OTFs, most OTFs have a little bit of play side to side, up and down. This is rock solid like a vault, and the action is absolutely amazing. These are USA made and just incredible knives. Titanium, and then the one that John Wick is gonna be carrying is the one similar, or exactly like this, just with a different inlay. It's just gonna be, I think, just a shred carbon fiber, which is still a carbon fiber inlay. But we're gonna check out a couple other models that are the same knife, but just with different inlays. So what is so awesome about the G&G Hawk Deadlock? Well, if you take an OTF, all OTFs, they have a little bit of play, which is movement in the blade. And some have more than others, just depends on what company and what brand it is. Some have uh, a lot and some have very little, but they all have play. Well, now the G&G Hawk Deadlock has zero play. And when I say zero, I mean rock solid lockup. And the way it's able to achieve that is it has the stop pin built into the blade and this mechanism built into the blade with a plate. And as it comes out, when it engages, it kind of shifts over and locks into place and it has that stop pin built into the blade. And then it also has some balls that engage. So the whole system and mechanism is super innovative and super awesome. But since all OTFs have this issue, it's amazing that the Hawk Deadlock was able to figure out how to make these rock solid. You can check this one out. This one's got the nice orange, orangish red pattern. You see the clip right here, how it moves up. So you can pinch it, put it right in your pocket, which is very unique as well. These are made with premium materials, very, very sharp double-edged daggers. And this one right here, oh, it's probably my favorite one of them all. It's just absolutely gorgeous. And these buttons, if you see the stair step effect, they're very easy to deploy. Like there, there's still the tension there, so you're not gonna accidentally fire it off, but it feels so clean and so smooth. Like I've fired hundreds of OTFs, and this is by far the best one I've ever experienced. It's just such a clean fire. And we got a couple more to check out right over here because this one is the new Serge Panchico designed one. We've recently had some Serge Panchico designs on the channel. This is the OTF that he's doing with G&G. &G. These things are just amazing. Then we have one more right here with the scroll work. Woo, that is pretty. Now, I do want to thank Gavin Hawk and his team for being so kind to us and allowing us to film and being so cool with us. We sat there and um, talked to him for a minute, and he was super awesome to me and my lovely wife, Kara. So I do want to thank Gavin Hawk and his team for making this possible.